What is up, Obscure Mike people? Bart coming at you yet again with uh, yet another. Been a while since I've done one of these. Been a while. And it's the Boya Link. Oh, Boya, I bet you were excited for that. The Boya Link. This is actually pretty cool. I will tell you I am using this connected to a Ceramonic USB sound card adapter because this is meant for your smart devices, your iPhone, your Android, and your camcorders of the world. Why? Why do you say that? Well, let's show you. Let's show you everything that comes with this and, and kind of go over why this is a pretty interesting solution for mobile audio. I almost said great mobile audio, but we don't know that yet. Let's take a look at the B-roll footage. Okay, so everything comes in this pretty sweet little carrying case. We've got our Boya box here. We've got some documentation that comes in the box. We've got plastic that the documentation came in. Silica gel pack, my favorite thing to snack on on a hot summer day. And a USB A to C cable, which is for this. We also get a Boya bag. Boya bag. Boya bag. Kind of a nice little microfiber clothy bag. Not too bad, nice touch. Let's get the box out of the way. Go full Boya here. You press the uh, little button here. We got charging indicator. We got some rubber feet on the bottom. We've got nothing on the side, nothing on the back, but a USB-C for charging. And as you can see, this is charging now. Now I do have two sets of these. One are mine. One is my good buddy, Jason Swishers, a channel member and a local fella that is uh, just a super nice dude, he borrowed this and bought one, and then in turn let me use it for B-roll and audio footage at the same time. So anyways, you press the little button to open the hatch, and we've got everything kind of charging. We've got two receivers here. Uh, it has a noise canceling feature, and to enable that, you hold the plus and minus at the same time until the button turns green. I think this accidentally, yeah, it was linked there for a moment because I've got multiple. So apparently, you know, I don't know how many you can hook up to this, but you got a mute switch. That's also the power switch. And like I said, you've got that noise reduction feature, but that is also the volume up and down little clip here to put on your color. And there's your microphone there. But nice, compact, small, little, yellow, different, all that good stuff. You get a little dead cat here. Just one to try with this, that, or the other. I'm sure you could buy another one. I'm not sure why it didn't come with two. Uh, but then you've got the receiver here. Now, the receiver also comes with two other pieces. So we've got a lightning adapter. We've got a... USB-C adapter, and we've got a TRS adapter. So you can switch these out. You got a little blue release button, and you pop that off just like so. And yeah, you can switch out, put the USB-C on. If you're rocking the Android phone, clicks right in there. If you switch to a iPhone with lightning, there you go. And Pretty cool. I mean, this is like a one-stop shop for any kind of device. You use this on your mirrorless or your camcorder or whatever you want to use. It's actually kind of sweet. Uh, you've got a power button here. You've got a mono or stereo button on the side there. Toggle, mono, stereo, whatever. Got a USB-C there so you can charge it if it's in a stationary device. That way you don't lose power there. Same with these, you can charge those as well. All in all, kind of a convenient package to record with any device almost. I mean, I'm using it with a computer, so that kind of that kind of says any device. Okay, so right now you are hearing this in just normal, regular mode. We're gonna do some uh, outdoor tests that I took back in July of 2023. That's how long I've had this. The Obscure Mike's channel is just busy these days. So let's take our receiver off. We're going to hold these two buttons down. And now it's green. So now that we've got the noise cancellation mode on, HD noise cancellation, it says. 
this should help with background noise, which I'm not in a noisy place. I'm in the studio. But let's cut to some B-roll footage outdoors and see how it handles that with more than one person with noise cancellation. Uh, I believe I used USB-C here on my Android device. So let's cut to that footage and then come back. All right, so I've got the Boyas plugged in. Why are this you This is USB-C is how I have them plugged in right now. You're going to hear a lot because it's me and my child. Kind of run to the slot so you can get it quickly. And they're playing some kind of weird bottle game. <laughs> okay. Pretty so cool, huh? what do I say? Nothing. Just play. Have a good time. Oh. Talk a little bit. Okay. And, uh, you know, you'll be in this video. Jude's been in the other ones. No. So you'll I'm be in this one. Go down here. Definitely no <sighs> camera stabilization on this sucker. <sighs> Not great at all. Or maybe it's oh, be, maybe it's because of the track. Oh, what's that over I there? I don't know. Go over there and find out. What so yeah, this is this? the microphones in action. Really nice build. I don't have the I windy muffs on. Nothing. Maybe I should. But there's no wind really, so I'd say it's probably fine. This is the USB-C hmm. test. I will probably plug in the 3.5 oh, millimeter really jacks next. I'm sure that. Connor's interrupting what I'm saying. Or maybe he's not, I don't know. <sighs> How's it going over there, Connor? Oh, this is a good, this is a great spot to have my water. Oh yeah, you should probably go get it. I'm thirsty. Connor, your water's over there on the bench, remember? Oh. Remember you left it all the way over there on the bench? You go over there and I'm gonna walk away to see if it, uh, if this cuts out much. He's going one way, I'll go the other. It's like a ghosty swing noise happening. Oh, water, <sighs> I don't water. Know. We're pretty far away from each other now. Go back. He's to way down the there. Table. Hey, Connor, say something. Oh, okay. I'm going to drink my water now. He's going to drink his water now. All right, we're back. Um, I think with a phone, this works pretty well. I think it sounds better with a phone than it does in a studio setting. Like, it's meant to be mobile. I think it sounds better mobile. I think it gives you a better idea of what kind of sound you can eke out of this thing outdoors in its element, not indoors way under the chin, but outdoors where it might be coming out a little more freely and all that good stuff. Let's go ahead and do this as well. If you were to hold this in like TikTok fashion, this is what it would sound like if you were talking kind of directly in it in TikTok fashion. Yeah. All right, now I have turned noise cancellation back off. Let's get to a BB saw review. The Boya Link, which is a very versatile device, is going to set you back 99 bucks. So if you think it does sound good enough to do some audio work outdoors, indoors, wherever, Again, pretty versatile. You can do a lot of things with it for 99 bucks. On the BB SAR, I am going to give the Boylink system a score of a seven, mostly based off the outdoor test because I feel that's where this shines. I feel like if you're doing something outside, more than one person, maybe recording an interview outside or just some kind of dialogue like that, I think that's what this is for. I do believe the noise reduction and overall sound quality is better on the Saramonic Blink Me B2, uh, but that is a more expensive device that comes in at $250. So you're looking at two and a half times the price. I think if you just want to accomplish some pretty good audio with a wide variety of ways to use it, I think the Boylink is pretty cool. Again, you use stuff like this, and unless you start spending a lot of money, the sound quality is typically going to be on the bad side, bad to mid. And I would say this is mid to upper mid as far as these kind of devices go. So I think there's a market for it at 99 bucks, especially with everything you can do for it. So I stand by the 7. I think it's pretty solid indeed. Boy, I did send it over for the sake of this review. I appreciate that. And I have used this thing quite a bit just for home movie stuff. 
outdoor family events. I used it quite a bit over the summer uh, to the point to where I forgot I was supposed to review it. Sorry. Obscure mics. Boy, link. Link in the description if it's something you could use. Peace out.